Hello everybody and welcome to another episode of Destiny Island's Top 10. There are a lot of Dream Eaters to choose from when it comes to assembling your party in Kingdom Hearts 3D, and today we're counting down our favorites. These are the Top 10 Dream Eaters in Dream Drop Distance. To be clear, this is a list of our favorite Dream Eaters based on appearance or how much we like to use them as members of our party. This is by no means a list of the most powerful Dream Eaters in the game. Number 10, Pegaslick. Coming in at number 10 is the Pegaslick. While we've never really used the Pegaslick consistently in our party, we put it on our list simply for the creature's design and appearance. Unfortunately, the Pegaslick is one of those Dream Eaters that looks cooler than it is, which is why it rests at the bottom of our countdown. Number 9, Kiba Tiger. The Kiba Tiger, while definitely being one of the cooler looking Dream Eaters, was such a disappointing letdown. Based on its intimidating appearance, we assumed it would be a lot more formidable in battle. Sadly, the Kiba Tiger's only real use is unlocking Dark Aura, Meteor, and Dark Splicer commands for Riku, which makes it essentially useless when playing as Sora. Number 8, Meow Wow. The Meow Wow is on our list 100% for its cuteness factor. While being pretty much useless in battle, the Meow Wow is adorable, especially when you care for it in the Dream Eater menu. It does unlock Cure, Cura, and Curaga commands pretty early into the game, so it's not completely worthless. But compared to other options, the Meow Wow is nothing more than an adorable cat, dog, thing. Yeah, we're not really sure either. Number 7, Jestabaki. Another Dream Eater who is here strictly for its appearance and perhaps the only thing cuter than the Meow Wow, the Jestabaki is just absolutely adorable. Like the Meow Wow, it's virtually useless in your party, though it does provide some pretty useful commands like Spark, Balloonra, and Collision Magnet. The main reason we love the Jestabaki so much is the way it sticks its tongue out at you when you care for it in the Dream Eater menu. Seriously, it's just too cute. Number 6, Cab Cannon. The Cab Cannon is one of the rare Dream Eaters that most people don't even get because it's only available one of two ways. You either need to synthesize two rather rare Dream Pieces, or you need to have the Cab Cannon AR card, which you could only get either randomly within your game purchase, or by pre-ordering the Mark of Mastery edition for the game. It's very powerful, very cool looking, and offers some really good commands like Zero Graviga, Salvation, and Dark Fyraga. It's a difficult Dream Eater to acquire, but it's one that's totally worth it. Number 5, Tyranto Rex. Just listen to that name, Tyranto Rex. It just sounds awesome. Never mind the fact that you have your very own freaking giant dinosaur to stomp all over your enemies. That, and it offers some amazing commands like Viraga Burst, Meteor Crash, and Mega Flare. Oh, and did I mention it's a freaking T Rex? Number 4, Aurelion. The Aurelion is powerful and just looks cool. It's definitely one of the more intimidating looking Dream Eaters, and it has the power and abilities to back it up. It also unlocks commands like Faith, Sacrifice, and Limit Storm, as well as tons of attack boost and attack haste abilities to help boost Sora's and Riku's offensive power. And most importantly, the Aurelion can help you unleash Trinity Limit. Number 3, Sarah Terror. Intimidating, powerful, and enormous. These are just a few of our favorite things about the Sarah Terror. It's really easy to create one using the Dream Pieces, as there are several different recipes that can synthesize one, and it offers commands like Zantetsuken, Dark Break, and the always amazing Sonic Blade. You can even get one pretty early on in the game, which makes your party a real force to be reckoned with right from the get-go. Number 2, Ryu Dragon. 
The Ryu Dragon always finds its way in our party. It's fast, vicious, powerful, and just looks really cool. I mean, it's a dragon. What's not to love? Couple that with the fact that it gives you commands like Firaga Burst, Meteor Crash, Mega Flare, and the ever-useful Super Glide, and you've got yourself a must-have ally for your party. Number 1, Lord Kairu. There's a true feeling of satisfaction in acquiring Lord Kairu for your team, as it is a real test of skill and patience to defeat it in battle. To get Lord Kairu on your side, you first have to find him in one of three different worlds, and it changes locations frequently. Next, you must take down its incredibly high HP, while dealing with not only Lord Kairu, but wave after relentless wave of Sir Kairus and Chef Kairus. The ensuing battle becomes an absolute frenzy of area attacks and flow motion maneuvers as you try to take Lord Kairu down. But once you have it in your party, all your hard work pays off. So that's it for our countdown of our top 10 favorite Dream Eaters in Dream Drop Distance. If you liked what you saw here, be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel to get alerts right when new episodes of Destiny Island's Top 10 come out. If you have an idea for a Top 10 list you'd like to see us cover on the show, be sure to leave it in the comments below. Until next time, I'm Other Promise 13 from DestinyIslands.com, and this has been Destiny Island's Top 10. <laughs>